We're here for IMATSci, which is a speed pitch for uh, earlier phase material sciences companies like ourselves. And so what we do is we have a nano material that we industrially manufacture in large factories the size of basically this entire city block. Our company has taken a 21st century nano uh, coating technology and we take 19th century paper to outperform 20th century plastic. Plastic was, a, was this miracle material, but how do we replace that? And obviously plastic's a big problem. So paper is nice and biodegradable and we're using the kind of 21st century materials of the Materials Research uh, Society to say, okay, we can upgrade that. Well, this is a pretty cool event for us to be able to reach out and talk to potential investors, industrial partners for an early stage startup like us. It's a pretty great way to get exposure. I'm with Guardian Technologies and what we're developing is a new type of charge detector that essentially eliminates vacuum and high voltage systems that are critical for analytical instruments from residual gas analyzers to mass spectrometers to even some surface science equipment. We are commercializing an optical polymer technology that uh, is for 3D imaging and what we do is make a wide field of view scalable optics um, for, for the 3D imaging market. We're here to network. Uh, we've been, we were here in 2019 before COVID and the other companies that come here are absolutely fabulous. A lot of the investors, a lot of the big companies that come here, um, really solid community, really great people taking real world materials. And then unlike your typical startup, which is very software and actually doesn't have much technology, you have a bunch of PhD commercial people here who really know their stuff. I mean, the people from Dow, Ankle, places like that. They have PhDs, they've got 20 years of commercial experience, and they know what they're doing and how to take technologies from the bench, and they know what it looks like to do it on an industrial scale and to commercialize that nationally. We're looking to raise a round in 2023, so our first contact with investors would be an amazing thing. Uh, we're also hiring, so trying to identify a couple engineers to bring on board would be really nice as well. Given the access to uh, angels in the chemical industry, there it's a pr that's a perfect fit for what we're doing because we're a materials-based company and this, these are the right investors.